Hello and welcome back to StarCraft. Last time we went through the tutorial and now we're going to be going through the actual scenarios. We're going to be going through the actual game. So the first one is called Wasteland. Office of the Colonial Magistrate, Ma Sarakani. Advisor! Ajutant Tun... Ajutant? 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 I have no idea how to say that. Online. Good evening, Magistrate. I'll fill you in on what's been happening. Confederate traffic has increased substantially within the system due to the recent protoss destruction of the Chowsara colony. The Confederates have tightened security on all outlying systems, and it's likely that this colony will be locked down as well. An encrypted Confederate transmission came for you while you were at dinner. Replaying transmission. General Duke. Greetings, Magistrate. I am General Edmund, Duke of the Confederate Security Forces, Alpha Squadron. The entire Confederacy has been quarantined. This. the. fuck. The Confederacy has quarantined this entire planet and will proceed with the lockdown within 48 hours. You to relocate your core colonists to the outlaying wastelands. Now I know there won't be any problems with these new arrangements. Transmission ended. I have contacted the local marshal, James Raynor. Raynor has agreed to meet you personnel en route and has called them to the new wasteland site. So our objectives are to find Raynor, build a barracks, and command ten marines. And here we are. You can select multiple units by pressing the A button and dragging a box around them, or by pressing the R button to select multiple units. So yeah, we need to go down there. I can't believe we're being sent to the wasteland. These Confederates think they can push anyone around. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Let's move. And as you can see, the wastelands hold horrors. Dead skeletons everywhere. And... Howdy boys, I'm Jim Raynard, the marshal of these parts. Let's move. Rock and roll. New mission objective, Raynard must survive. So, I'm gonna, go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna switch in these accents every five minutes because I'm gonna go, forget go, go. them. Well, I keep pressing B instead of A and G. As you can see, these things are here. They don't like us very much. Uh, we're going to want to select all of the SCVs and uh, tell them to build. Or well, I guess tell them to mine. And uh, let's build one more SCV. Oh, they mine eight minerals. What a weird number. Okay. So, for duty. next up, I want to build a barracks once we get 150. Go, okay, I can't select that. I need to have the... Okay. Gee, I remember back in the day when uh, summers were hell for me, especially with recording stuff, because everything was loud, and I had no idea how to actually have decent audio quality. I wouldn't call my quality particularly great. I'd call it decent, though. Uh, so how many Marines do we have? We have five. Do we have a way to heal our units? So let's build another SCV while we wait. If we need to command 10 Marines, right? And, uh, like, we have five, you know, we have six population space. We could fit in one more SCV. Yeah. SCV, good to go, sir. Wait, what? Oh, it adds population space when you try to build one, not when... Ah, okay. That makes more sense. Can I send more than one SCV and... 
Ooh. I think I can. It isn't doing it. There can only be one working on them at one time. Ah, okay. Anytime you're ready. So, yeah. We all need... To, yeah. Marine counter activated. Not enough minerals. Okay. So now we need to just wait for the five marines to complete. Here's a funny story. If, let's go up there. I'm pretty sure that's in this map. Is it? Or is that another map? No, it is this one. Yeah. There's a bunch of these angry shits everywhere. And there's this weird bunker. Uh, but warning, we're gonna get attacked now. So... Do these things... Uh, okay, so they appear to stop following us when they're a specific, like distance away from us. Okay. Can I get you to, uh... repair a unit? Target is not... What? Is Reynolds in perfect health? Yeah, he has 300 hit points, so... Well... Because I was uh, curious specifically with the way... Hmm. You want a piece of me, boy? Okay, so once that guy trains, these particular objectives should be done. Wait, can I? Timer game speed. Oh wow, we can speed up how fast the game runs. You want a piece of You're victorious. Okay. That is surprising. So there we are. We have a bunch of score. Da -da -da -da. Oh, we're fighting against the Zerg. Interesting. The Zerg has a bunch of creatures. So, this is going to be Mission 2, Backwater Station, Office of the Colony Magistrate, Marsara Colony. Advisor! Receiving incoming transmission. Comlink established. Hey, what's up there? Got your refugees tucked in nice and tight? Provided you can sidestep any more surprises from our Confederate friends, we can keep them away from those critters. They should have an easy time. Priority alert. Backwater station under attack by unknown alien organisms. Distress beacon activated at 0658. Alerting Confederate headquarters on Tarsanis. Stand by for incoming transmission. We've already received the distress beacon from Backwater and we'll take care of it. You just sit tight. You'll be notified if there's anything we think you need to know. Give me a break. Listen, if we wait for these Confederate reinforcements, that station's dust. I'll head out there now and do what I can. You send in some militia and we'll save those folks, trust me. So we have to eradicate the alien infestation and Reno must survive. I'm glad to see you, boys. So very quickly, underneath settings, I will lower down the speed to what it was previously. Wait, it's gonna probably it's probably previously in medium. Maybe. Uh we'll see. So obviously the first thing we need to do is build some SCVs. Anytime you're out, it's fun. Sounds fun. Okay, oh actually. Select him and send him a bit back because he is not replaceable. So yeah, we're gonna be digging stuff with our little SCVs. Interestingly enough, it may be worth it to just for the future because we're not gonna be building, you know, any 
you know, military troops yet. We can probably get away with plopping down our big military base a bit up further north. Yeah, like somewhere here. And then we can hit land and... There we go. Ain't that cool? Like, in what other game have you seen somebody have the ability to physically lift their fucking base off the ground? Not enough minerals. And then... Not enough minerals. Okay, that's quite a lot of SCVs. I think I'm gonna stop after I order them to construct a new one. So, if I select the building thing, ground upgrades, infantry armor, infantry weapons, ground research, stim pack, academy. We can't build an academy. We can build an engineering bay, though, and uh, that will be what I'm going to see if I can build. Because if we can't build an academy for some reason, then there's no point in trying to find, you know, gas to harvest. Look at this gas here. Actually, let's see. Okay, we have two things. Ooh, infantry weapons requires engineering bay. Okay. So let's build an engineering bay here somewhere. And while that's being worked on, we can uh, work in some military personnel that we can build. Yeah, we're current academy, but we can't build one for some reason. I bet you this kind of looks weird on recording. Here's the thing, so when these recordings go up to uh, websites like YouTube, there's quite a bit of re-encoding which happens, and uh, one of the results of those re-encodings is that the colors get kinda a little bit more messy than I'd like. Essentially, like, things will look a bit muddier. Especially in lower pixel stuff, because of the way the colors are subsampled. It it, it won't look terrible. It just maybe won't look as sharp as native. So what I've done, because the way this is captured is this is a. Uh, how do I explain this? It's basically directly capturing a like 480p frame buffer. So, well, it's not directly capturing it, but it's doing the next best thing. And, um, because of that, when it's in, like, this sort of, like, when it's in the main menu, uh, if you can see the weird, like, main menu stuff, this is because it's interlaced, and I'm just using Weave to deinterlace it, which isn't very good, but it's okay. At least for a YouTube video. And because the game is running in 240p, and the recording is uh, doesn't magically change the resolution when I'm in game. Uh, it means that basically for every pixel in game, four real life pixels, you know, comprise it. Which, because of the way this works, results in actually not bad pixel quality because uh, compression can't fuck it up as much. Okay, so we have quite a few guys. Me, oh, I completely forgot. So, tech-wise, uh, we will need... Oh, we don't even need to... Hmm. Okay, we're gonna want good weapons and good armor, so let's start working on that. Actually, uh, just for the fun of it, let's build a second engineering bay. Not enough minerals. What do you mean, not enough minerals? Not enough minerals. Okay, because that way we can get them faster. We're gonna want roughly a hundred. Oh, by the way, yeah, we're gonna start the, these minerals on forever. As you can see, there's a hundred in this patch, 
100 in that patch and 500 in that patch. So, sooner than later, we're going to be out of resources and we're going to need to search for more. And how do we search for more resources? Well, we want to start scouting. Knowing where everything is is important. Oh, shit. Okay, that is where the enemy is. Okay. So now... Oh, this is nearly finished. I don't remember how many resources this takes. I want the upgrades to be done as soon as possible. Yeah, okay. So we can create, like, three more of these guys right now. But this is more than enough. So... Let's send them up there to kick some ass. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit, we sent an SCV with us. Uh, well, buddy, you know what? You can go back. Looks like the ground there is alive. Yeah, this is one of the uh, sort of well-known things of the Zerg. They can only build on this thing called Creep. You'll see why I'm taking an SCV with me, though. So, we need to kill the, uh, creep. Like, we need to kill this thing before it starts shooting out more units. And here's where we discover something. You see this? There's two SCVs here. And if we go up north with the SCVs... Well, would you look at that? There's a bunch of... Well, we have five fire bats. And, uh... Well, look at that. What is the ComSat thing? Well, we would need more Vespian gas for that. Actually, just for fun... Uh, let's build a refinery so we can start collecting Vespine gas. You'll see why a bit later. Okay, we'll move up there, but uh, obviously uh, we're going to want some of these SCVs to uh, start mining the resources here, and I'll move in the combat units up there. We can now build fire bats because there's an academy here. So... Okay, yeah, so it is actually good that we uh, started building that. Hmm, we should have built it earlier. And as you can see... A lot of these units are gonna soon be out of a job. Because there's only so many minerals that there are over here. That is why I'll send a few of them up north, where they can collect some gas for us. And right now, as you can see, our tech is slowly being upgraded. So, what we're gonna wanna do is we're gonna wanna build... Uh... We're, we're already building units. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think one of them wandered too close. Okay, I think this is enough for an advance. We can always move back. Upgrade complete. So that is our first upgrade. Now we're going to have better weapons for our infantry. Okay, that guy was annihilated. Okay, so I'll move these units up here. And, uh, remove these guys. Okay. So, whilst everything else is being done... Can we research? Oh yeah, tech? We can get stem packs. Uh, let's build some more fire bats. Ah, shit, who's being under attack? One guy wandered off. 
Okay. Jimmy. Hello, Jimmy. Let's go. Gee, those are big things in there. They don't play very nice. Hmm. Wait, I see more of them. See them? Down there. Upgrade complete. Okay, so now we have better armor. That should mean that, uh, you know, we can play more defensively. Not more defensively. We lose less units per attack. Wait, they're up there. But they're still... Interesting. There's still stuff down there. Hold on. Go down here. Oh, wait. Okay. Let's... Okay, so now they have... So those should, if we power them, they should have heightened abilities for a short period of time. Okay, this seems to be the place where all the creepy foolies are. Grouping up. Okay, but we are destroying them at least. Oh, yeah. This little choke point is annoying though. So let's push all of our units into here. Okay, we need we need to destroy. Shit, come on. What do they do to which? Group? Oh, gee. Very good question. But I don't think it's something particularly nice. Did I overprepare? Oh, yeah. Maybe a little. Oh, yeah. Gee, okay, kill these things, please. So, we still haven't explored. Uh, there could be still more aliens down there. Fire it up, Send more people down there. Anytime Come you on, ready. attack it. Fire it up. You got it. Is there a way to get over here? Ah, oh, shit, there is. Okay, we need to go back. Uh... Okay. So, let's build a bunch more fire bats. And... Boom! So, yeah. I... Receiving incoming transmission. Marshal Reno, by destroying a vital Confederate installation, you and your men have violated standing standing colonial law. If we hadn't burned that factory, this entire colony would have been overrun. I didn't come to here to talk with you. Now throw down them weapons. Guess you wouldn't be a Confederate if you weren't a complete pain in the rump. Do we win? Yes, we do. As we can clearly see, we did quite well. We uh, didn't produce as many units. We killed way more units. Yeah, we know how it goes. Uh, the Zerg didn't mine any resources. And uh, for next time, we'll be doing Desperate Alliance. So, see you next time when we do Desperate Alliance. Goodbye.